I am currently booted into a uh, live CD of Slitaz, the base text mode. And uh, we're going to look at today simply creating your own little dialog box, which is very simple to do with a program called Dialog. Now, when you're in Slitaz, there you'll probably see in some of the scripts a command called Taz Dialog. And Taz Dialog is actually the same thing as Dialog, as far as I can tell. And uh, Dialog is, in, is available on many distributions of Linux. So this is something useful that you can use not only in Slitaz, but other Dialog or other distros as well. And it's very simple to use. If we type in Dialog dash dash title, and then in quotations put the title of our Dialog box, we'll say uh, hello world, of course. Uh, and then we can do dash dash message box, msg box, and in quotations put what we want in the box, we'll say this is some text, close the quotations, and then the size of the box, uh, it's going to be height by width, I'll say 5 by 50, I'll hit enter, and you can see that the uh, text box right there, uh, you can hit enter, puts OK and exits out of the box. Now I can show you, I can make this larger, I can say 20 here, and you can see we have a bigger box, so we change the height. Um, now, if you want more than one line in your text there, you can use the backslash n, so here I can go into my message and say backslash n space, and I can say this is a new line, and hit enter, and you can see it says this new line, and actually it the reason there's a space there is because I put a space in there that I probably don't need. Let's see. There we go. And so you can have multiple lines of text just using the new line character. Another line is here. There you go. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, uh, if you put zeros for the size of the box, it will make it just big enough to fit what it needs to fit. So there we have uh, our three lines in a box, and it has space for three lines. If we go back here to where we only had one line, and I put zero, zero for the size, you can see it made it small enough. It actually wrapped the text around, but it, it doesn't, uh, you know, if you put zero, zero, it will default to fit what you need to fit. Now, at the same time, if we have something like this, three lines in a large box, if we change the number to something like two for the height and hit enter, oh, that's uh, not quite right. Let's hit OK there. That did not quite work like I was expecting it to. Uh, <laughs> let's try one. Okay, we got hello world. Let's try five might not want to go lower than five on that to get the box. But you notice that it says, hello world. It says the first line of text. And over to the side, it says 33%. Because we are only looking at a third of the text, if I use my arrow keys, I can scroll through the different lines of text and hit OK. Let's do that same thing. We'll add a few more lines. We'll go new line, uh, test new line tester, new line this is a test, new line how about a test, okay. And we'll change 5 to 10 on the height there. So, oh, that actually fit all our text. Let's do something a little bit smaller. Let's try 6. Okay, so we got two lines at a time now. And you can see as I hit down, we scroll through it line by line. And the percentage off to the side here tells us how much we have read so far. Anyway, that was just a quick look. Dialog, if you type in dialog, or as I said, Taz dialog, um, and hit enter, you can see there are a lot of options. You can make uh, input boxes, select boxes, yes, no boxes, password boxes, and uh, calendars, checklists. So uh, we'll get more into that in future tutorials, but I just want to show you how to create a simple dialog box in Slitaz or really any distribution of Linux using uh, the dialog command. Uh, and Slitaz actually uses this command for a lot 
of its uh, scripts and uh, and stuff so it's very lightweight and knowing how to use it allows you to create your own little menus or modify the ones that are already on the system anyway thanks for watching and visit filmsbychris.com or bashscripts.info for more video tutorials like this have a great day